need to enjoy the experience we are, we are, we are in now. And I uh, hope come tomorrow now to come tomorrow at five. We'll be talking of, uh, of good news. You have been here. Uh, what's your take in, in terms of your operations uh, from the moment you arrived here in Mudawa up to now? Uh, so far, so good. You know, we came here on, uh, on Tuesday night and uh, we managed to train here on, on Wednesday morning. Then yesterday we had an afternoon after session. Then today, this morning, we had, we had a morning session because, that, as you know, the pay calf rules. Uh, pirates will come and train in the afternoon here. Yeah. So far, so good. I can't complain. I think uh, we, we receive, we, the people here received us very well. And I can't complain. I think every time we've been here, uh, it, it, the people here have been good to us. So I would uh, want to say thank you to the people of, of Blawayo for, for the warm welcome that they gave to us. You have always called Blawayo your home. And um, obviously everyone else is expecting um, you to express it in terms of a win as well. What would you like to promise? I know you've expressed to the players that they must just go there and enjoy themselves. But to the fans, what would you like to say? Yeah, they need to come in numbers, you know, at the end of the day. Uh, as for supporters, we, we, can't, we can't force anybody to come and give us maximum support. Those who will come, in, come, in, those who will come tomorrow and, and give us max, maximum support, as, as I would say thank you in advance for those who will be supporting the opponents. It's football. It's, it's no more all over the world. But the most important thing is for us to, to, to deliver, get a positive result for whoever who is coming to, to give us that maximum support. I think that's the most important thing. Have you ever felt the way you feel right now in football as a coach? No, I always feel the same. Both football is the same all over the world. Ed Mochi Ramadan, he joined from uh, Keza Chiefs. Uh, his papers in order. You know, he wasn't playing for Keza Chiefs. I think he was playing for, for, for Division 1 club in Jobek. The papers are not yet, uh, they are not yet here. So he's out. He's out of this game. He's, he's going to be out again when he go to Tunisia. Are you concerned about Rakwashi uh, Mahash? I, I, I'm not worried about, I'm not, I don't get worried about individuals. The only player who I can say I'll be worried about is Nelo Messi. <laughs> not, not anybody who's coming from, from this side, no. We don't concentrate on, 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 on individuals here as a club. We concentrate with the whole team. We could I one player alone. There will be about 17 players maybe to, 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 to give him everything. But so if you're going to think about only could I watch my heart, then I don't think we're supposed to be as, as coaches and even footballers. The journey that has been uh, travelled by FC Platinum, what sort of inspiration would you say um, you gain, you, you're getting from the, from the journey that has been travelled by the club from uh, back in the day when it, you know, it went through it's, the phases from the time when it was the big team, so-called big team that were always looked at? It's a massive journey, a massive journey, you know, I think uh, everybody's aware, I, came, I joined this club in 2014, you know, and uh, we've been working so hard to be where we are today. You know, and uh, when we started this journey of, 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 of this uh, Champions League, nobody, I think, gave us a chance because everybody was talking about we got hammered five, we got hammered four. It's the nature of the game. But, you know, I think uh, hard work, perseverance, uh, if, if, if made us to be here today. So I, I always say thank you to the Almighty God because without Him, I don't think we'll be here today. But I think we've worked so hard for this. Like I said, let the guys enjoy this uh, this. Uh, this experience was we've worked out for this. A follow up to that, um, I was going to say you have enjoyed this journey and you seem to be obviously much better and happy with FC Platinum. Uh, what would you say are some of the things that make you drive you as Norman Marquez? Because people are surprised why would he turn down a national team call up? Why would he turn this team and also follow his uh, passion and vision for FC Platinum? As for national, national call ups, I've never turned down any national call ups. I think you remember last year when, 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 when I went for the Liberia game. If, if things were not okay with me, I, I would have said no. But you know, this is our nation, this is our country. We're all from Zimbabwe. When it's a, when it's a, it's a national team, it's a national call, we have, to, we have to go. But at the end of the day, you know, I think sometimes uh, if, if, if you don't succeed in whatever you want to do in life, that drives you to push more effort, to put more effort. I think, you know, it's not like, you know, the past, the past few years we have been failing to reach our targets. In 2014, our target was to, 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 to be number four on the log. Then come 2015, it was number three. Then 2016, it was number two. 
2017, we won the league. Last season, we won the league. So those were the targets. But unfortunately, people, they, they never knew about those targets. So every, every go, they were going to say, ah, you know, FC Platinum, they are, they are always near so team, near so team, near so team. But those were not the objectives. We had the objectives as a club, and I also have the objectives as a coach. But at the end of the day, like I said, uh, hard work, a perseverance, a determination, that's, that's what always drives most of the time. Most of the time, those three things, hard work, determination, and perseverance, they are the, they, they, those are the most important things in my life, and they always, they always push me every, every day when I get up and go for work. And then, Coach, how would you describe the Papa Fields uh, tough? Uh, it's, it's looking okay. It's looking okay, you know, and uh, I can't complain. We, we just hope, you know, tomorrow we play good football, you know, under, under, under such conditions. Good tough, good, good, good pitch. Uh, this leaves us to thank you, Coach, and all the best and better luck with your team. Yeah, What's your comment?